Hello friends, welcome to my channel Learn with Reshu. In this tutorial, I will going to explain you class attribute in the HTML5. So let's start. The HTML class attribute is used to specify a class for an HTML element. Multiple HTML element can share the same class. Using the class attribute, it's often uh, we need to point out the class name in the style sheet. It can also be used by a JavaScript to access and manipulate elements with a specific class name. Um, for example, if, have, if we have three div elements with a class attribute uh, with the value of, uh, for example, city, and uh, all of these three div elements will be styled equally according to the dot city style definition in the head section so let's take an example first i will de uh, delete this so it will looks nice so i delete this and i add a html uh, no, i i will add a div div element so i will add three div elements So suppose you have three divs in your body tag okay div tags and if you want to define this uh, div tag with a class city so you see here you have city 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 so uh, for example if you pro uh, pro provide the all elements a city so what will what we can do is in this style sheet we can put dot city use dot city and add the um, CSS accord, uh, for all these three um, divs at the same time. How? So what we can do is we can add a style sheet for example like this. Instead of this I use a style tag. So I use like this style sheet tag. So you see I have a dot city and background color tomato, color text color white, bo border, margin, padding, everything I give by the dot city. So this dot extension dot city I can refer the all these three divs all together. So how it will look? I, I refresh. So you see there are three divs London, Paris, Tokyo all divs are having same kind of design so by this class uh, attribute i can do this and uh, um, yeah so uh, for example uh, if i have two span elements with the class attribute with the value of node both spam elements will be styled equally according to the dot not style not definition in the head section how uh, for example uh, if we have a two a span like this so for example if we have a header tag and then I have a span of important and heading. So in this important, I have a class node and a same in this important, I have a class node. So for uh, this, this is spam tag uh, is using, for example, same words. So this important and this important is the same word. And I want to do some styling on the, in those two uh, words, same, th same styling for those two words. So what I can do is I can choose class node, class attribute and put the same ID for both. Same node and node and I can put styling for both at the same time. How? Like this. So I can put like this. Dot node and this. So if I save this, it will look like this. My important heading this is some important text so you see here is the same thing same block of code so it's if we um, select it becomes blue but uh, color is red 
and font size is 120 percent okay so because it was heading h1 that's why it's bold and very big in size and because this was a paragraph so that's why it's small text so i hope you understand why it's big and small and uh, same thing what we can do is uh, uh, we can use multiple classes as well so for uh, to define multiple classes separate class name with the space um, we can give so uh, the element will be styled according to the class specified so if for example in this div i specify main as well so in the for example i specify here main so there are two classes so main and class so what happen is we can refer main and class uh, main and um, city both how uh, we look uh, for example if i place a uh, style sheet for main different like this so for uh, we can uh, here what i want to explain is if we use city and main so we can choose either city or main both words can be used for as a class attribute so here main dot main uh, text alignment center so this alignment will be in center let's have a look so you see london becomes in center uh, so that's how uh, we can define uh, two different classes and uh, yeah we can use javascript uh, the basic inform uh, the basic uh, use of this class very uh, class attribute is in javascript so we can use uh, we can use a class attribute uh, to uh, to create a javascript function so for example um, uh, in the in this in the coming tutorial i will explain you how to create a javascript function for now it's okay and uh, now uh, I, I think that that's it for this video today so please keep watching and in my next video i will explain you how to use javascript in html thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe Bye-bye.